Hey everybody, the horse racing kid is signing on the handicap races from Santa Anita Park here on Sunday, March the 14th, 2010. Please turn your clocks ahead tomorrow. It's daylight. Let's see. Daylight savings time begins. So yeah, so I have two calendar timing. This one from, uh, wait. This is the Santa Anita one. This is the aqueduct one. So turn your, ahead uh, your clocks. And... Today is the first running of the Clockers Corner Handicap. That's why I said this here. $55,000 added six a handicap for Phillies Mares. Four olds and up going six and a half a beat down the hill. And I'm going with the one-two here. Number one, Manhattan Beach. Mike Mitchell. Last time out, they run six and a half at San Anita. One by a half a length. Then ran at Del Mar, five furlongs on their turf course, came in second by half length. Then ran in uh, Ireland at Navon at five furlongs, came in eighth at Limerick, Ireland, seven furlongs, one by three and a quarter lengths, and a second at Curric in Ireland. Very good horse here, five and two. I think this horse should handle going down the hill. Garrett Gomez is the rider at 12 to one, nice price. I'm going with number two here, too. Parato Marme, four to one, Chantel Sutherland. Last time out, did win the Wishing Well Stakes by one length at 11 to 1. Came out, stir rallied. Then ran in the SK Malde at Oak Tree. Came in 7th. Won the Great Lady Handicap at 6 furlongs. At 5 to 5 furlongs in Lawndale at Hollywood. Came in 3rd. 2nd in Lounge Race at San Diego. 3rd. Last year's Wishing Well came in 4th. Going down, 9 and 2 going down the hill here. I like this one. So recap my bets for race number eight. The first running of the Clockers Corner race number eight from San Anita. I'm going with the one, two, exact, and both cross board box. So it's the horse racing kids signing off for number. Good luck. Please comment and subscribe.